So what do we want to talk about? Almost 10 years ago to the day of Matteo Manassero's BMW PGA victory at Wentworth, he is back in the winner's circle. It sunk in pretty, pretty quickly, to be honest. Uh, I had, uh, you know, I had my wife there, I had all, a lot of friends there, and it was, um, I don't know, maybe it's just the, the whole experience I went through that made me uh, be in the moment much more than other times. She doesn't carry for me often. Uh, and it was, I guess it's almost destiny that she had to be there uh, in that moment. You know, no matter how many more wins I'm gonna get, uh, but that one together, it's always gonna be, it's always gonna be really special. And it was meant to be like that. It's nice to see how happy uh, the, the guys that were there uh, where <laughs> Lorenzo is going mad. It's what we play for. That's, it's obvious, but it really is because it's something that very few people can experience and, and it's amazing. It was uh, a lot of uh, steps uh, and a lot of bricks to build, uh, to build the house and, and eventually uh, get, to, get to the win in Copenhagen. The way your swing feels, is connected to, to, to the mind a lot, and, and the two things need to work good, both of them. So I took it from both sides. I hope it was gonna, it was gonna be less than 10 years, but <laughs> you, you never control what happens uh, with golf. It's, uh, it's so difficult and, and very, very unpredictable. It's 10 years, so it's, it's so much time and, and so many things. Of course, I, you know, I guess it, it, the second part of my career is more normal than the first one uh, in some ways, because what happened at the beginning was, uh, you know, unique. History is made in Castillo. Manny the Tour's youngest winner, the Spanish gold, is Manaceros. Look at this, this is dream gold. <laughs> Amazing stuff. And we have a 20-year-old champion at the BMW PGA Championship, the brilliant Matteo Manassero. What happened in the second part of my career was uh, a build-up to create something that, that, can, that, that hopefully can last. When you play at a really high level, you have a lot of expectations. It's just difficult and it's a big mind struggle, mental struggle to get out there and not feeling uh, ready to be out there. And the golf course doesn't really, you know, never lies. And when we go out there and we feel that something is, is off, then we're scared of that thing, really, because it's, we feel that we cannot really do it. If you can put in perspective that golf is our job, is 50% is, is of our life, but, you know, things can get better uh, if you are uh, on, on the right path. I never really thought I'm, I'm going to quit, no, no, I, I didn't, but I did think that years are going by and, and, and I, I would love to see something that gives me a kick of confidence. Yeah, Denmark was, was that, for sure, uh, that gave me a motivation that you know, told me you can feel like that again and, and, that's, and that's worth working. You know, for years, since I started to play less, uh, you know, worst, I was chasing it. Now I'm there, uh, and I and I need to keep going.